Idaho has about 100, well, over 100 golf courses within the state. And we're going to be looking at all 100 and bringing you the top 10 public golf courses within the state. But before we do, take a look at our channel. We're hitting all the public golf courses in each state along with the top golf courses in every country and a lot of golf in between. But without further ado, let's zoom in now to number 10 on this list. Of course, it has some fantastic deals. It's got 4 p.m., $12. So you know it's a pretty cheap golf course. It's a part 70 that stretches 6,325 yards with a slope of 129 and a ranking of 70.7. It is built in 1982 and it's open year round. It was built by Robert Rang. It's going to move us now into number nine on this list of top public golf courses. We're headed to the southern part of the state where a river cuts through this championship course. There's a total of 27 holes to choose from at this facility. And the golf rate is pretty reasonable where it can only go up to about $45 total. So you know you're going to get some pretty good deals here as well. But that's going to move us now into eight more golf courses to look at in this amazing state with some incredible golf let's zoom in now as we move closer to the northern part of the state at this public municipal course this par 72 stretches 6359 yards with a slope of 125 a rating of 69.8 it was built in 1974 and it's about about 30 bucks to play it's pretty reasonable we got seven more golf courses to look at and number seven is a course that world twilight golf for this channel is bringing you the footage of as we continue to hit every golf course across the country and the world we're bringing you that footage and this is a course we were able to play now we're going to put it at number seven because we look forward to seeing more of the golf within the state but this was a great 18 hole golf course to come out and play this link style course is 6554 yards with the slope of 72 bar 72 and was built in 2000 it had some name changes and it's a great 18 hole course there and the next course is another link style course but it's important to know that we're going to be constantly updating these videos periodically let's zoom in now to number six on this list it's a par 72 that stretches 6614 yards with a slope of 140 124 and a rating of 71.8. It was built in 2000 and it has everything you need to get you started for some incredible golf. Now, believe it or not, we have broken that list in half. We're bringing you the top five golf courses. Now let's zoom in now to number five on this list. And with a ton of history, it was built in 1934, which is incredibly old for the area. Its golf season is only from June to the end of November. It's a municipal course that stretches 6,221 yards. It has a rating of 69.7 and a slope of 117. It's a par 71 and it has three tee boxes to choose from. Preferably it's a walking course and Golf rates go for about $16 at this course. That's pretty reasonable. That's going to now move us into the top four golf courses. Let's quickly move into number four. With a few nine-hole golf courses to choose from, you got to put them together. The Challenging Course, the Freedom Course, and then also the Robin Hood Course, which is for everyday fun. Interesting. Now, it's about $40 to play the course and go up to about 50 on the weekdays, but it does have some decent twilight rates for 35 It's a pretty great golf course. Should be a little bit higher than this list maybe, but we're going to put it at number four. And just like that, we have three more golf courses to look at. The top three golf courses through the state that you could play. Some better private, but I think only got public here. Zoom in now to number three. Built in 2004. This par 72 stretches 7,287 yards. It's built by Gary Lynn. And it's got, it's got a lot to offer. About four tee boxes, a slope of 136, and a rating of 74.3. It's pretty reasonable under 40 bucks. Zoom in now 
to number two on this list. It's a tight course here. A lot of houses, not a fan. We're going to give it number two. Everyone thinks it should be a little even higher. Definitely one of the more expensive courses, but it stretches 6,890 yards with a slope of 149 and a rating of 79.5. It was built in 1999. It's a pretty challenging course. It's blunt grass greens, bluegrass fairways. Let's zoom in now to our number one course, northern part of the state. This is just a remarkable number one course here. Got to give it to them. It's a par 71 that stretches 6,803 yards with a slope of 127 and a rating of 71.8. It's got that unique par 3 there that you can see. This is just a remarkable golf course built in 1991. It's bent grass greens, bent grass Lost fairways. Houston, we are by Scott long. Miller. Let's get to it for this list. Keep it looking out for more videos to come. This is World Twilight Offer.